everyone. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to Instagram. It has been, I say, two weeks since we see each other on live. Let me clean the screen a little bit. So we just come back from Orlando show uh, about two days now. So uh, I am back on live. And today we're going to do three different live. So on here, I want to demonstrate like beach scene on here. And then after this, I want to make a video right away after today live. And then uh, I am, when I'm done, I'm going to go ahead and go to TikTok to do a character painting live uh, called Bugs Live. So I want to paint some bugs from the movie Bugs Live using my new graffiti pen. Since everybody is excited about it, I want to do a lot of it because I really love the graffiti pen. And then uh, tonight, we're going to have a full crystal live on Crystal Nail Fairy. So we're going to have three different lives today. Hello. Hi, artists for live. Hello. Hi, uh, Ella. Now slay. Oh, yes. So I'm going to pin my website now. Okay, website is www.tinovo.shop. And then I will add in customer service number. Her name is Kyla. Her phone number is 417-772-4020. I'm going to pin it right here. All right. Good Hello, morning, Abby Every single person that's joined us today. We missed everybody. Well, except for her. We, but everybody else, we missed you a whole bunch of <laughs> Oh, or two just have new leather pants. Oh, don't tell them where you can get your clothes, honey. Hi, Kiki. Kiki met us at the premiere. It was the biggest show ever. Our, our, our boot is like packed in the high time. So I'm very happy with the show this time. I, I feel like I get enough attention that I deserve. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hi, Doreen. Hello. Oh, oh Helen Huster. I'm glad you can make it. Today, I'm going to do three. So, one on here, then TikTok in the afternoon, and then uh, Instagram Live later on at 6 p.m. for Crystal. Oh, no. So, if you can, you can watch three of my show today. Three. Okay, let me see. Hi, Aline. Hello, Michelle. Hello. Hi, Maria. Yeah. <laughs> Maria, visit oh. us in... Um, Orlando premiere. I had a wonderful time with her. Oh, <laughs> Where is it? Let, let's, let's give a big shout out to Next Chapter Nails. She did something really cool. She did this star nail set that everybody Lens, has yes. been ecstatic about. Except for me. I, I liked it at first. The nails are beautiful. But now, now, Hi, secretary oh, needs a secretary. Oh my God. I love, I love that set. It's amazing. I was kind of emotional when I look at it. Hi, Tiffany. Hello, hello. Hello, Paul. It's me pretty. It was hello, fabulous. Leanne. Nice it to meet you. Really Hi, nice. Leanne. Matter of fact, we stayed down I like your accent. Two days just because of your accent. That's what <laughs> I, I like your accent, Leanne. <laughs> Hi, Priscilla. Okay. I uh, need a name for his supporter, like Kendra Chi. Call her supporter, Kendra. I don't know. You can help me make a name. I don't know, like... Like boho or something for the supporter. <laughs> well, we're gonna have different, you know. Like, uh, like Beyonce. We, we uh, wouldn't want to show everybody in the same group. What we're gonna do is we're gonna have <laughs> we're gonna have different groups of supporters. That way, they can name themselves. We didn't want to. <laughs> and it was very nice meeting. Bling queens. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, update on the kittens. Hello, Alette. We uh. After we couldn't squeeze the kittens out before we left, we went ahead and glued her JJ shut. And yeah. when we came back, we put a little ass on. We use crystal magic glue crystal. to glue it shut. And then we want to go home. We, we take ass on and we just tie it out. And all the kittens are spilling out. Spilling <laughs> out, right. Yeah. Hi, Nora. Hello, Nora. Hello, Jen. Oh, thank you. Paul, it's me pretty. Uh, hello, Nikki. Thank you, Nikki. Let me say hi to the rest before I started. Blink Queen, got it strength like Blink Queen. It's a pleasure to meet you and have a little chat. Thank you, Art Nails, Art X Nails. 
Hand Hustler say she like Vose Ho. Okay. Let me get ready. Let me connect myself first. So, Votino. First, it's all the start. Oh, smoothly this morning. Huh? Smoothly. Smoothly? Yeah, it's ready. Oh. Ooh. And then you hit us with the cycle. Kick, 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 kick. Okay, it's ready. All right, let me turn this over. I am ready. Let's start with a uh, beach set first. The beach set. Mm -hmm. You might want to mention one more time what your schedule is going to be the next few days because I know it's like when you switch. Okay. A couple hundred people jump in. So, um, my schedule today and tomorrow going to be live. We're going to do three different live each day. So, it's going to be six different live. And then, do you get my saran wrap yet? Yes. Okay. And then, uh, after this two days I, I am gonna be back on live again on friday <laughs> it's friday so from now on i decide that i'm gonna do four days a week live of course i'm gonna do like a few live a day like three live a day that's my plan and then after uh four days i need three days to do content and all my uh, personal work so that is the balance that i think i would need Honey, can you do that? Can do what? Say. Say. Hi, Neon. Yeah. Hello, Neon. Okay. So, in the show, I demonstrate this. Okay. I never demonstrate this uh, to our live audience. I demonstrate it at show. And you know I have a good uh, 30, 40 different techniques a show uh, technique that I don't really demonstrate on live. So today I want to demonstrate this technique, but I'm going to add in like umbrella, beach ball, seagull, sun, sunrise, whatever. Um, so Florida vibes. Florida vibe because today, uh, right now it's summer. So this design consists of this texture effect gel technique with stained glass gel. It consists of bubble effect. I'm gonna demonstrate. I hope I still have it. Let me check. Let me make sure. I yes, I have my bubble effect. And then sugar gels. Who mix? I will mix with uh, tan pigments. So I'm gonna get it out here. Oh, Leanne said that's near the sweetest person I've ever met. Oh, what about Tino? <laughs> yes, <it's a> Tino. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. It's just so I can try later. Wanted to do it while live so I could ask a question when I had problems. But yes. dang, son's sleeping where all my stuff's at. You just gotta, you just gotta kick him to the side. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I have this. Now it's right here. Okay, now I'm gonna have art gel out. Blue art gels and white art gels have it out. Let's make a pretty uh, sky color. I want it lighter. Now, art gel, you know, it can adhere as chrome and then it can adhere as pigment. So today I am going to use art gel for pigment. Have some blue out. You know what? What's that? We did meet Mac. Yes. 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 And, you know, I kind of liked him before we left, but now, <laughs> no go. No, oh we have oh, a class with Matt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, we met a whole dad team, too. I met Deb, and oh, my God, I love Danielle. Uh -huh. Oh, my God, I love Danielle so much. <sighs> and then I met Tim's. I love Tim, too. I met everyone at short. Jenny was there. I do... <sighs> God, so to Sailor Moon, I do for Jenny. She don't even wear it. 
she had to wear her crystal nails because a press doesn't give her any press on so do, she couldn't complete the set do you sell tips on your website uh tip yes i do it's in essential category uh we're gonna skip vegas show yes we're not gonna go to vegas because i'm gonna be busy um turquoise just a little turquoise actually you know what look green because i want this guy to be kind of like uh a little bit sunny so you add a little green and that will brighten it up make it like what, what uh, is that lofi no what's yeah. this Oh, stuff. Okay. The, uh, no copyright stuff that we okay. found out is actually a group. <laughs> okay. Mm. Yes. Met Matt. Met Maria. That was a lot of fun. Yes. Hang out with Maria. She's a doll. Uh, well, when will Queer Silicone be back? In, uh, in about a month. About a month. Mm -hmm. It's ready to ship. Okay, so this background is for my sky. I'm using blue, white, 50% blue, 50% white, and a little bit of green. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to pan half of the nails. Where is my flat brush? I'm on your brush now. So I just come home. Uh, Morning, how much beginner nail tech should take for acrylic set? Uh, I'm not sure. You mean like she, if she want to charge it, just depend on the area, really. Check a couple of salons, see how much they charge, and then that will be your average. When I tell you I'm in love with Tino's products, he need a membership like Glam has that <laughs> comes in handy every few months when I need to re-up. <laughs> Maybe? We, we are considered. Um, she, since... says she sounds like a drug dealer. Yes, well, yes. Cindy have uh, organized for me a room, a classroom in Dream Time, a big one. Shh, don't get him too excited. All right. So guys. we are going this week to set up, and uh, I am gonna fill that room up with Crystal, Crystal Kid. So because I'm about to take Crystal seriously, so I'm very excited about this uh, new space that we have gonna have at Dream Time. Uh, we're gonna do a couple of live there too. Um, so I'm gonna do a similar type of work like I did here down at Dream Time. But Dream Time have all the crystal that I want, and I can also do some uh, photo update and photo shoot for the website. And they want too. They just haven't seen them yet. Oh man. The Play Palace, we'll call it. Hey Heather. So um, we're doing several lives today, and then yes. what we're gonna do at the very end of it is. Talk Tino and have you come by. Yes. Today? Maybe. Maybe. If Maybe. we have time. If we have time. Yes. So Heather, we'll see how he feels at the end of the day. I tell Heather maybe Tuesday, Wednesday. Have you already talked But yeah, I, oh. I talked to her. But I mean it could be today I, if I have if time. You've already... okay. I, I thought you hadn't answered responded yet. Okay. Ooh, they love your pretty blue color, honey. Thank you. <laughs> oh, and now what I do different is I take my TikTok live, I add it into a video, and the voiceovers. <laughs> I did uh, my first voiceover yesterday. It had been like a year since I do any voiceovers. So that's going to be a thing from now on for TikTok. I have decided that that's TikTok friendly. Okay, Lotus Beauty. Um, you, you asked how much time will a nail, new nail tech take for an acrylic oh. set uh well should i should i give what i would consider uh -huh. good advice Just first what you want to do is make sure that you're doing it right and take your time i wouldn't get in a hurry yes. and get all your actions down because the speed will come um when i first started it took me three hours and i get it down to 45 minutes um tammy taylor first started it took her eight hours so you get it down to 12 minutes a full set, which is a world record in the uh, nails world. So um, I recommend you to take all the time you need because you need to get it correctly. If you try to rush, then you're going to mess up your nails. 
um, you mess up your technique. And then when you work for years and years and years, what you will have with you is the bad technique that you already developed for yourself. So down, uh, down the road, along the way, you will become a horrible nail tech and you will not be able to charge um, two or $300 set. You will have to charge people $30, $40 set or even discount to $25 set and eventually your back will give out and you're gonna quit uh, your job and you probably will end up working at a gas station. Or robbing banks. That's or robbing you banks. Know I mean. So my advice to you, my best advice to you, you wanna practice. And, your acrylic and yes he said 12 minutes yes now know this when i met tino i didn't have any idea still don't most about the nail world but he would spend sleepless nights just practicing practice, practicing practice. the horseshoe shape the horseshoe shape <laughs> yes and then i knew it was out of control the horseshoe filing from tammy taylor that uh, she taught me the horseshoe filing i practiced it over and over again kid this hours for and 60 hours. seconds and then when i knew how intense you were about everything because i have to get it right metrodome. remember the metrodome yes deep, 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 deep. and i taught myself every time it ding it's ding for 30 seconds i taught myself uh, when I do now for my client, it's all about the timing. I put on earphone and I time myself because I don't have time to look, look at the clock. Uh, that is when, after I practice, that is when I play with my speed. But when I practice, I take all the time that I need for me to get it correctly. And after a year of intense practice, I was ready to work on client. Then I do for about uh, 20 different clients correctly. Um, it's take a little long, but I charge price accordingly and it was a beautiful set. After about 20 clients that I'm happy with the result, they're like, oh, please keep me. I'm your prisoner of love now. <laughs> so after all that uh, approval from the client, approval. now I'm playing with my speed. I'm trying to, <clears throat> but I already have a good muscle memory. So now I'm playing with my timing. But I never play with my timing first. That will be foolish of you. Yeah. So slow practice, repetition. Mm -hmm. uh, before I'm doing anything else, I need to unbreak this. Exclusive now says, didn't she use double forms for that? Uh, Tammy Taylor? Mm -hmm. Tammy Taylor only used her, her uh, one form. Uh, Tammy Taylor is considered old school. So she never used double form, I don't think. Because... Um, the performing um, length uh, for the performing is only popular about four or five years. Tammy Taylor is about 20 years ago. So 20 years ago, this shape is ridiculously well, long. She has by now. Maybe this kind of shape right here would be like pretty long Ideal. for back then, yeah. yeah. Okay, so now before I do anything else, I'm going to take my indigo pigment and I'm going to fade it up from here. Well, Nick is Sunflower Nails. Congratulations. Started at new shop tomorrow. Nice. Says so nervous but excited. That's, that's the best. The, oh, shoot. I have some Aston out. Good morning, Becky Frost. Hello, Becky Frost. Okay, my indigo pigments. I'm going to pick up a few. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to fade it from the top down. So it show like a um, like right here like a dark blue sky. So over here, it can be like a sun dry beaming from the ocean. And let me just go ahead and get this out of the way. Notice my facial. Get this out of the way. Hello, Matt. <laughs> it's Matt, yeah. <laughs> Hi, Matt. <laughs> so it's a good thing you're in school. <laughs> Are you in school right now? Yeah, well, he's been going to nail school. Oh. And I'm thinking when he gets that done, he needs to take a computer class <laughs> god mad man boy god. Thank, wow. thank, thanks god for john i know right so helpful yeah yeah <laughs> good thing we don't listen to people though because matt would have had us done and you know but we're just, just the kind that we keep on trying we don't want to take no as an answer we didn't get to go to dinner with matt because deb uh have obligation with her teammate so, but I just only want to hang out with Deb and Matt, so we didn't get to uh, get chance to have dinner this time. Maybe next time, next year, in the next Orlando.
Orlando show. We decide we might go to another show. I don't know. To depend on how we feel. Hello. Right now, Chicago tried to offer us a deal on the booth so we can show up there, but I don't know. I don't like Chicago. Heather said, regardless, 12 minutes is impressive. As a client, I'd rather my nail tech take their time and do a good job. Exactly. Tacky leaves clients unhappy. That's it. They don't yes. want to come back. So, you know, kind of only deal with people that you feel comfortable with, you yes. know? One of these days, we'll figure out how to... I mean, the only way I, I can put this now is you can't be desperate. Right. You've got to practice. You have to practice. We want to go to Gatlinburg, but um, after a lot of talk with Cindy and consideration, we're thinking not. Yeah, because um, Gatlinburg is not really a big one for us to bring Cindy and Ron if we just want to go alone, we have to know how to operate a cash register. Right. We couldn't even get the TV going. Although that's, you know, I'm, I'm gonna... San Antonio is in our consideration right now. We still consider it. Yes. Uh, Chicago, I don't know. The booth that they offer us is like all the way in the back. I'm trying to hear so I like, mm -mm, no way. I want to be out in the front. Oh. Did you hear that? I hear that. No puppy. Oh. Well, like you, you abandoned us for weeks. So we think that you need to discuss it with our animals because they weren't too happy about this. We know everyone else was happy, including us, about it. But the puppies, on the other hand, whew, good thing Mama Kitten held those things in. <laughs> it was so magical. It was midnight or after midnight. Like one or two o'clock, whatever it is, uh, time it is. How do you make the perfect baby boom? Baby boom? Uh -huh. Like a baby boom? I don't know what that is. Perfect baby boom. You mean this? This right here, you seen not, it. I'm not sure. So what is a baby boom? Yeah, you have to. If she mean baby boomer now, it's like a, a child ombre with a pink and white. Uh, that is a child ombre technique. If she mean this right here, uh, what I do is I make sure that I knock off all the excess dust. Oh, this this lady needs help. So I order a lot of your products. I love them. However, I have trouble working with gel effect and texture effect. Texture effect. They are not. They are not dry after sixty seconds on the mm. top. I tried to use thinner line. Yes, I'm about to use it right now. All right, so stay tuned. He's going to mm -hmm. show you the secret. And make sure you use about fifty watt uh, long U flash here. You know. a, an actual nail lamp. Mm -hmm. An actual nail lamp. Yes, I'm about to do it, so you're about to see it. In Holland, we call Oak Tea it, it Baby Boom. Oak Tea? I don't know. I don't, uh -huh. know. I don't know. We have no idea what you're talking about. Like a baby? Like when, an actual when, baby? Well, when I hear baby boom, I think of an exploding baby. <laughs> it's not, I'm, I'm sure that's not what they... Are you talking about blood splatter? Blood splatter. <laughs> Okay, so I'm soaking it in acetone. Oh, I guess what you're doing, they call that baby boom. Oh, baby boom, you're seeing in it. In Holland. The trick, uh, the trick is you have to knock off all the dust. See that? Now, this brush right here, after soaking in acetone, I soak it all up and I switch brush. Oh, ombre, the white and pink, I think. Oh, yes. The trick, see, I'm going to do it again so you get a chance to see it again. Okay, now this, using a pigment brush, smudge it out, knock it over. So this is the first technique, it's the sky, uh, I'm going to do the ombre, oh baby boom. The baby boom. I'm doing the baby boom. <laughs> okay, see so you, you have to knock it off or else it's going to splatter all over the, your surface, you have to knock it off first. Okay. Baby now, boom makes me think old. Now, when you have a hard time ombre in this, because you have a heavy hand, make sure you take the brush and run over the paper towel a few times. That way, it get lighter for you. You know, it's easier to ombre. If you have too much pigment on your brush, it will be harder. If you have a heavy hand, if you have a light hand, good for you. 
Scottish Trin says, maybe it's the waters or the lamp. I've never had an issue with the gel texture mm -hmm. effect. You're about to see it. So make sure that every step that I do, you cover. Uh, first is moderate layer of uh, texture effect gel. Second, make sure you use the right lamp because some sometimes people use a flash cure lamp. I don't know why. Sometimes they use a flash cure lamp. So make sure you use an actual 50 watt lamp. For now, LED light or uh, UV light would be okay too. And now dad, uh, give us, because this is what dads do and he missed our, uh, you know how deadbeat dads are, they just miss stuff, birthdays, all that kind of stuff. But, but he kicked in once a year, you know, as, He's a, as, amazing. as, a, as a bad dad will, but he came in with a, 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 a hundred watt lamp. Now we've not tried to use it yet, but that may even be better than the ones, ones that we have been using. Yes. We will let you know soon. Yes. Or he's a deadbeat dad. <laughs> I will give you proper feedback on uh, the lamp that I will try next with, uh, from John. And then, watts. and then, speaking of deadbeat dads, our Clive, the father cat, is not a deadbeat dad. He's amazing. We, it was the most amazing thing. He came in. He was helping pull kittens out of the JJ. He was licking kittens licking clean. Kitten. Chewing umbilical cords. Mama Cat at one point was curled up on him, being the most oh it's amazing. It was, it was an amazing thing. Okay, so I'm done with the first technique is the ombre technique. You see, art gel cannot hear pigment too. Beside chrome, it cannot hear pigment. So now I'm done with this. I'm gonna move it over here. Move this station over here. Okay, now time for me to use Ooh. texture effect gels. So, I'm looking for flat and ombre, and using a flat brush. Have you tried hitting the side of the lid with the butter knife like opening a pickle jar? Oh. No, not enough for me. It's not enough. <laughs> it's not enough because I need to really knock it up. And I, when I do it um, on the pigment jar, um, it can get really messy. If I get really intense, it can get really messy. Okay, put it right here. Yes, a 120 watt lamp is what I believe it was. Texture effect gel. Like we can use it as a tanning bed. All right. Now, texture effect gel, I'm using white. I am about to make the ocean surface right here. I'm taking texture effect gel out. Um, somebody had a question. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Uh, uh, do you cure every in between? Do you cure every in between? No, cure all at once, and then boot pigment all at once. You know, I remember you leaving that scarf behind. Good morning, Iris. Because I was like, it was a nice scarf, and I was like, man, let's keep this. <laughs> and then, I, and I was like, oh, you can't keep it. I'm like, all right, let's sell it. You know, we're in Chicago, we can. But now dad was like, no, nah, let's just send it back to her. <laughs> Gosh. And I did everything I could to make sure that they didn't know whose it was, but boy, they found out. Uh, do you cure? Yeah, yes, he cures in between some things. Art gel out here for 60 seconds. Do not cure in between. Cure all of it for 60 seconds and then wood pigment, babe, wood pigment on. That is what I just did. Now, I am going to put on texture effect gel. I want to make sure that it's level. Yeah, that what I did is I mix uh, my background. I keep for 60 seconds. Yeah, they want to know about the sky blue. Yes. Okay. I keep for 60 seconds. Do not keep in between. I don't know what that means. I keep for 60 seconds, all of it. After I'm done killing all of it for 60 seconds, I put on my pigments because when after a cure, it can apply, uh, adhere pigments. So after I cure 
my art gel for 60 seconds, I put on my pigment on the dry layer of art gel. I don't partially cure it or I don't cure it for a little bit or cure in between. I cure it for 60 seconds. Good morning, me for one, two, three. Hello, Neil for one, two, three. What is today's design? It is Floridian. Beach scene. Beach. So the first technique that I demonstrate is how to adhere pigment to art gel. The second technique is going to be white texture effect gels. So now I already level out all my, uh, I call this the water, the base of the waters. So I am put in a thin layer of white texture effect gel. Okay, uh, just about right here will be good for me. Yeah, just about right here. Do it to all of them. Do not cure it though. I'm not ready for it to cure yet. Keep it wet. I will say one third of the nails. Third of the nail. Mm -hmm. Um, they had five beautiful black kittens. Yes. I only see two that have a teeny tiny tip of white at the very tip of their tail, but we're gonna color that in with a permanent marker later on, so they never got. <laughs> Okay, so in the middle, I'll make it a little deeper. And then on the side, it's not as deep. So you can see the dimension that I have here. Okay. I missed the conversation between Ashley and uh and uh okay. TLC so if it was four and two I should just text us later on and we'll figure it out okay now I am gonna wash this in alcohol and then dry this I am going to take a scissor and a saran wrap and I am going to cut some saran wrap. I didn't realize this was saran. I thought it was serene wrap. It sounds so it, is that what it is? Well, I call it serene wrap. I call it saran wrap. Remember? Yeah, it's alcohol now by Katifa. Good morning Renita we missed you also the kittens are all black so right now we have five six seven eight did I count early nine black cats actually I want to put it the other way well thank you vibe effects You know, we, we missed everybody too. Yes. Okay. Oh, that's a that's a good question. What's that? You know, and Dustin, um, are all the products cured sixty nine seconds at sixty? Sixty second, uh huh. And LED lamp. Yes. Why some curing lamps label UV and LED lamp, and some just LED? Uh, back in the old day, all we use is uh, UV light, but now LED is faster. Uh, I haven't yet bumped into a lamp that is say both LED and uh, UV. It doesn't make any sense. 
probably just false advertisement, but it, LED is way faster than UV. UV is a type of lamp where you have to replace the bulb. Every time you uh, it burn out, you have to replace it. Um, that's UV. LED is a type of light that is small, it's round. You cannot replace though. You just have to yield your lamp for like three years or four years. When it burn out, you just buy another one. That is uh, LED. Now, I don't know about the nail world, but what I do know about lights is LED is a light emitting diode, which is a fake false light, whereas UV is ultraviolet, which is mimicking the sun. Right. Yeah, so if your light, if you don't have to uh, replay the bulb now and then, then it's not UV. Because UV, I remember, is so annoying. You have to like replace it. And you have to know how to replace it. Yeah, you have to open the light and you replay the bulb and everything. I remember It's that. so annoying. Is that where we just start buying lamps? I'm like, oh, I'm not doing this. Flash key. Okay, so you need a flash key. These have sold out at the uh, show, so I'm very happy about this. It's like show out on the first day, the flash key light. <laughs> it, doesn't make, it doesn't make any sense. I, I don't even really use it hardly. Oh, I use it for this. That's why it's sold out. Most of our stuff was sold out at the show. Which it was a very successful show. And thank you for everyone to support me there. Okay, I flash gear this so I can put it in the machine. I don't, I don't let my client put a wet nail in the machine because I don't trust them. And, 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 and Tino's thanking you for that. Let me just say thank you to Nails by Nicole for bringing me some damn trail mix peanuts <laughs> from Trader Joe's that had Oh. It had chocolate chips in it. Oh, God. Uh, hello, Chelsea. Hi, Chelsea. She was, we got to meet her. She was a pleasure. You know, uh, for this ketchup fat gel, I put a very thin layer because I don't want it to go up really high. So it's difficult to take the pawn and kind of pour it. So I just use a side and I pour it like this. Make it crinkle. But kind of in a direction of um, horizontal direction for the water. No, she's not here. I, 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 don't, I only like to talk good about people when they're not around. <laughs> <laughs> when they're around, you roast them. When I'm around, I roast them. <laughs> Which, you know, some may find that mean, but, you know, just pretend I'm a shitty client. It's to toughen your skin a little bit. <laughs> oh, okay. Now, when I peel this, I will want to hold it on the side because, you know, I want it to be nice and neat. I don't want it to pop out on the side. So I hold it on the side a little bit. And yes, yes. Now I got the double stuffed Oreo, Tino, and Dustin sandwich picture. <laughs> okay. Done with this. See, now it looks kind of like waterish. All I need to do is boost stained glass gel on that, and I'm in good business. Good business. Good business. Not bad business. Not bad business. <laughs> Aw, I missed you, Quay. Hi, Quay. God, we tried Al by Alabama. Surprisingly, Alabama is amazing. What do you mean, surprisingly? Well, I thought it's going to be like redneck country, but it's not. It's, it's amazing. It's... it's all the restaurant there, all the scenery there. I love Alabama now. But you love rednecks too. Right? Well, I, I thought Alabama is a deep south, you know, where they hate Asian, hate, hate uh, diversity. But no, Alabama is wonderful. Yeah, and they have accents. They have beautiful accents. Yeah. We stay at Holiday Inn. That's where we stay. And I get drunk. And you got drunk? On Moscato, I uh, I hang out by the pool and I fall asleep floating in the water and doesn't just leave me there in the waters. Well, he took a picture of me in the waters where I passing out. You were com you sleep completely still, so I knew you were safe. I and I and I got the pool hook and dragged you slowly over to the side. But if I would have woke you up, you would have probably fell in. I wouldn't mind living in Alabama. Uh, what products are you using, honey? I'm using clear texture effect gels. Thank you, Sleep Queen. Says everybody loves Tino. They do. And if they don't, beware. Beware. <laughs> Arkansas scare me a little bit. 
in Arkansas, in uh, I don't know where we were at. We, it was a bad gas station. But uh, we stopped by that gas station and like I'm not, I'm not getting. Hand pump the gas. Yeah, <laughs> so I'm, I said I'm not getting out. I will pee in the cup. <laughs> I said no, doesn't. You get, you you go in, cut, you know. I blend in. You blend in. Just call it like it is. I did not blend in at all. You you guys. You I was like, mm -mm. Mm. I recognize this vibe before. You <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> That's just a very rural part of Arkansas. That's right. That's right. Honey Pot sells. You assume that because Alabama, because you listen to the news. Right. I listen, right. watching on the news, like, like uh, Alabama, they hate gay, they hate diversity. You know, but when we down there, it was wonderful. Oh my God, it was amazing in Alabama. I personally have, have, have given up on following yeah, any of the news the police because we have seen so many So many fake news. It's just absolutely, truly fake. Yeah. We stopped by Alabama two times. One when we uh, yeah, we got on the way. In Alabama, I yeah, guess say. we we entered, we, we stayed, we moved a little farther, and we're like, man, this place is so beautiful. So we stayed two times. One when we left, and one when we come back. So we were, were we took our time. We we looked at the yeah. Oh, see what she just said. The hills have eyes. That's what I. Is that in Alabama? The hill have eyes? We didn't know where it was, but that's what exactly what it reminded me of. I was like, oh, the hill have mean, eyes. That's Arkansas. That's more like Arkansas. The hill have eyes. Is that where? Oh, this is just a vibe that I get <laughs> from that town. From that town that have piece of land. The rest of Arkansas is beautiful. It was just that particular town. Yeah, they have piece of land instead of piece of hut. It's that piece of land. Instead of pizza in, they got piece of land. Piece of land. Right. I was like, mm. <laughs> and then I I go, we go to stop by that gas station, and I saw that guy, and I was like, hmm, and then he just spit. Like, <laughs> Look at I like, oh no, I'm not getting out. That's when he spit. Um, you you go in, but I'm not going in because he just spit. Well, the only reason I stopped is because you had to pee. <laughs> you know, I thought if I'm ever gonna, this might be the last time for biscuits and gravy. <laughs> Orlando, Florida, in Tampa, amazingly, they have the best biscuit and gravy ever. I didn't know that Florida would have the best biscuit and gravy. I thought that's a thing for us in the South, but no, they have the best biscuit and gravy ever. In Tampa, in Hot Rock Cafe, which we are a big fan of Hot Rock Cafe now, we're going to stop by every time. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. Oh, yeah, I love hot dogs. You know, baby, the whole trip is nasty black. I'm gonna watch out for any uh, residue, and I'm just gonna cut it all out. Just cut it out right here too. Ooh. Yeah, I, I I just pee in the cup. I'm like, mm, I, I don't okay. know, Dustin. One, one good thing about being a boy. And Dustin come back with uh two uh Casey pizza <laughs> that are super greasy and then come with this like macaroni and cheese, which I think it's still alive. I don't think it's cooked yet. I got a little very I was worried about eating it on the way. So when we <laughs> drive back home, we also Stopped by Arkansas. I was I'm so hungry. <laughs> Let's look at for some restaurant. But I look around like listen, I better be careful looking at this restaurant. So we found a Mexican restaurant. I was so happy, like, yes, listen, there's a Mexican restaurant right there. We have to go in. Mm -hmm. I think I'm fitting. We we like Florida a lot. Florida is amazing. Uh, you cutting off pieces that are sticking out? Yeah, because, you know, I, I don't want to, like, uh, overlay this. I just want to put top cone and call it a day. So you don't want it to be too high or it will be bumpy for you. Then you just have to uh, overlay it. It's still okay, but I'm not in the mood to overlay right now. So. You're not in the mood to overlay. Yeah, cutting it out and then shape it a little bit. Prep is important, but then it will make your job easier in the long run. Now, I'm just gonna 
fry or the fry a little bit. If you ask me fry or up some texture effect gel, no worry. It's on the side. Don't worry about that. Yes, I'm gonna go live on TikTok after. Um, I do want to um spend about 30 minutes or an hour after this Instagram live to do video immediately. So I don't so it's not building up on me. So on my days off, I have time to do something else. Just slightly buff it up. Be careful, don't hurt the pigment up here. I can't wait to boost tank latch out on these textures. Amazing. I cure for 60 seconds, by the way. There. That's why I make white texture effect because black texture effect, you couldn't do this. And boost and glass gel on because you cannot see anything. But white texture effect, you can see all the texture when you boost and glass gel on. Dust it up a little bit. Make sure everything's clean up. Just a little bit. Beautiful, honey. Thank you. All right, we are ready for stained glass gels. And thank you for uh, purchasing my stained glass gels. At the show, it's very popular at the show, and I decided I'm gonna have uh, maybe a few more colors. And then after I have a few more colors uh, that are necessary for shading and all that, I'm gonna make different collection, like a bright collection, a rich collection, a shading collection. So stained glass gel number eight is what I'm gonna use. It's really deep. It's a deep blue. We enjoyed meeting you too, now, boss. I would say we pretty much enjoyed meeting everyone. The whole entire show, except for Matt. Matt. <laughs> okay, but um, right, the line. It's the texture line is not straight. Now is your chance to make it straight. I mean, I don't like to make things straight. Cause I'm gay, but you know. Mm -hmm. This is an exception. It's an exception. Okay. Now, after I have my texture on, uh, do you want to clean it up just a little bit? The more you clean it, the more you can see the texture. So clean it up just a little bit. It depends on you now. Play around with it. Here. See the ocean that I made? Oh, and Tara, we got you some crystals. Oh, yes. Beautiful mm -hmm. crystals. That's a show. And a couple things that, that no one else could ever get. Okay. Is the stained glass gel like <laughs> jelly gel? It is. It's like jelly gel. I specifically make each group of stained glass gel with light pigment or with rich pigment, depend on the color for a certain special effect. Cut more stained, uh, more jelly gel collection. They either too light or they either too dark. But I have different group of stained glass gels. Different groups. Mm -hmm. But I'm about to have some uh, beige and some umber color for shading. And I want a bright red. Good. I have a deep red already. I want a bright red. Good day, Germany. Good day. Hello, Tuan. Tuan. I hate it when I get halfway through saying something and I realize I can't <laughs> pronounce it right. And then boom, there we are, stuck in the middle. That's it. Smith said, thank you for answering the question. You're welcome. And Maya, I hope you get the feeling better. She said her family isn't abandoned her what? and yeah yeah i'm not sure exactly the whole you know they've locked her in her room oh that's not like one of those exorcist things you know what i mean it is she said there's a 
preacher involved. Oh, yeah, yeah. Like, uh, like, um, what is it? Like, what's that movie? The Exorcist. Yeah. Or Emily Rose. Emily Rose. So she's she's been possessed and taken over. Oh, that's fun. Yeah. Think of the badass nail art you can do now. Right. <laughs> And do smoky nails. Uh, yeah, we got five of the cutest little kittens. Now they're 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 not even what maybe. No, they hours just yeah. Old. We cannot hold them yet. Yeah, we're gonna wait till tomorrow, and then we're gonna. Mama's still bonding with them. We're gonna have a new show. Um, question, man, are you a couple because you look all? Oh, you know what? We should get married. We should. <laughs> we're a couple. Yes, we are a couple for nine years. Uh, this July 4 will be our 10th anniversary. She said it looks like that right now. Yeah, the exorcist. <laughs> you did say, say some pretty damn good work. That was nice. Okay, so we have the ocean down. Oh, Drew Image said you're a classy whore. Ooh. Oh, that's... wait, no, I guess it's classic whore. Oh, oh. exorcist. Okay, oh. I got it. I'm so confused and excited at yeah, the I same time. Too. I was like, oh, I like it. I was like, I like it, but I don't know if I like it, but well, I do. Because you can afford the, the put out, you know, it's, it's, it's the whole thing. <laughs> Before I do anything else, we need some cloud on the sky. Clouds? Yes. So this is a second technique that I teach in today. Third technique are simple, just cloud. So a palette out, you will probably need some pop cokes. Yes. Shine it. Ten beautiful years yes except for that one day <laughs> one day <laughs> okay cloud and then um art gel i'm gonna use for cloud so take out art gel i'm almost using all of it you, you're almost using all of it i need more art gel do your special way uh i'm gonna do it to show everyone how to do it. Okay. Okay. Uh, stained glass number eight? Yes. Yes. Stained glass gel number eight. I feel like he answered me without really looking, though. I mean, uh, it is. Yes, it is eight. Or if you hold it the other way, it's 800. Okay, so I'm going to open my art gel. Zach to knife. Um, we got five kittens, and she did absolutely, absolutely great by it. They were just spewing out. She didn't even look like she struggled. She didn't pant. She didn't, and Clyde, Clyde was there helping her. You got your red trash card. And then before uh, you open, after you open anything, got to mix it to make everything even. Clean up the side. Gel paint Blanca is white, correct? Blanca is white. C. S me art gel. Uh, so yeah, I'm not art gels. And it's L Blanca. C. I'm about to take Spanish soon. We, now we're back. I'm ready for school. Art gel here. Put it on the side. Oh, that was cute. Pat said it was an honor for me to see your work. Thank you. Do you take apprenticeships? Uh, apprenticeship? Right now, you are my apprentice right now. For free? Yeah, for free. I need a um, oval brush. Good morning, Mama Big. Okay. So I'm going to get a, um, actually, a round brush would be good. Good morning, Isora. Isora? No, a pointy brush would be fine. All right. You know, you, you're getting delusional. I feel like you need a little sip of water. You got to fix everything. And wasn't Tino just absolutely adorable at the show? The nada, Francia. And his little cuteness. All right. Cloud, please. So, let me think of uh, how many cloud. Okay. One right here. Stop. We were already in Orlando, Florida, just last week. Oh, well, brush. Okay. Uh, some top coat. Just a, just a little bit of top coat. 
and make sure not too much poquito small amount top coat and oh, fade out mm -hmm. poquito is small now again make sure you tell me if i'm out of lines looks pretty good from here hello england hello england okay go for brush How do you come up with all your amazing designs? You know what? That's an internal question that everyone wonders. Mm -hmm. At this point, I don't even know you guys. It just happens. It just happened. Good morning, Nail by Envy. Oh, look at this cloud. I'm proud of this cloud. I want to uh, cure this a little bit. Okay. Another one right here. Good morning, Teeth Bandit. Hello, Teeth Bandit. Is that gel polish or gel paint? Gel paint, art gel. Good morning, Simon Berkman. Hi, Simon. Germany, one of our favorite, favorite countries, then Australia. Okay. Just a little top coat refill. Just a little bit. Just shine it. I use shine it instead of mad it. You can use matte too, just as long as it's a clear top coat. To make everything go smoothly for you. Give it a light tap. Oh yes, beautiful. No. Do you like banana bread? I'm trying to decide if I should give up on my diet. You know what? <laughs> I don't like banana nut bread. You know. I'm just going to lie to myself. I feel like you're allergic to it. I'm using a pointy brush, by the way. It is a pointy brush. I don't like banana nut bread. This is always confuse myself. You're in good. You're in like like. What, what am I thinking? You in good hand. No. Similar company. Oh, what 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 was that? I confuse myself all the time. What's she talking about? Food or oh, nails? No, she got confused on something. Oh. And then Tara helped her. Oh oh oh. And then she said thank you. Oh yeah. Then she confuses herself. Thank you, Tara. I'm saying that I understand confusing yourself. Okay. I'm right, still thinking about the banana nut bread, so. Aww. You just light tap it just to fade it out. It don't have to be a perfect ombre. It's cloud. Cloud is not perfect. Mm. So you just choose to do design. <clears throat> so, we, you know. It's whatever he's feeling. Yeah. If people ask for requests, that absolutely kind of stops and blocks. Yeah. I'm a, I'm a trend maker, so whatever I do, I do. Grow. Right. Now that they're all helping you with excuses on why you can eat my banana nut bread. Oh, really? They do? It's obviously mine. What is the excuse? <laughs> what is little, some of the A little excuse? bit to build up energy so that you can... Energy? You know what? I Yes, because... I think oh! I done it. That's a good one. Strength on my diet. You know, and, and I remember us stopping at quite a few enough what I would consider diet-breaking restaurants on the way home, so... I sinned so bad on so many restaurants. <laughs> you really did. Oops. There was uh, this time when we had uh, Lake City, Florida, where there's no lake. And then um, there's this sushi restaurant. 
Yeah, we were in Lake City where there was no lake. Well, there's no lake and there's a sushi restaurant, but it's amazing because the fish is so good. Mm. <clears throat> ah, these. We are considering maybe Sacramento. Um, we just, hello, last lady. We hello, just lady. don't like planning too far ahead on anything. Yeah. We really love a sporadic life. Okay, you guys, up here, you can make mistake. Which for cloud, you shouldn't make mistake. You can though. If you you want. cannot make mistake because pigment here haven't been protected yet. If you uh, think that you made a mistake, you might want to boost a mat on or something before you do the cloud. But I mean, come on, you guys. Cloud? That's no mistake on cloud. Look at this. I'm just dabbing this. That's, that's no ugly cloud. All cloud is beautiful. See that? All of them? Take a wet brush and just kind of tap it on the bottom, and there you go. All cloud is beautiful. There's no ugly cloud. All of them. So you want to make sure the top is solid and then just use a wet brush and don't touch the top. Just touch the bottom and straighten it out like this. You don't even have to do a good fake job. Just a little bit. See that? Eventually you run out of gels and it's going to end up all clear down here and you're good to go. See that? That's cloud. Good morning. That was by Douglas. Hi, Douglas. See that? A little cloud here too. They're absolutely Cute this. Well they really they really honey are wanting you to gain weight and break your diet after so hey, what are you doing, puppy? <laughs> oh, uh I need to see this finger before I decide if I should add any cloud on this finger. Yes, more cloud on this finger. Leave the uh, middle part alone. Good morning. <laughs> Actually, I need another cloud here. I'm kind of addicted to cloud now because it's so easy. But you know, if you ever have any requests, just ask him. You know, DM him and uh, yeah. I'll throw it out there if I think it's fun or whatever. It's if the request is desirable, then I would like, hell yes. Did you wet the brush with alcohol? No, 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 no. I wet the brush with a little bit of top coat. Just any top coat. Just a little bit. Kind of like lubrication. Alcohol will not help at all. Because yeah. it's a solvent. You need uh, a, a gel type, like a top coat. How long have you been doing nails for, baby? Uh, I have been doing nails for 14 years. You know, I just realized I kind of caught you at the beginning of it. Uh, you caught me at um, no, about please. six years. In. Well, you were, it was before they had any real products. Right. And you were a mad scientist, I thought. Right. I was mixing and inventing and all that crap. Mm -hmm. And then I tried to make chrome powders, tried to make mirror powder, I say. And then I go into the wood. And when I'm uh, getting out about uh, two years, um, when I, I'm getting out of the woods. Yeah, I disappear <laughs> on the from the scene for about two years. But when I get out, I there's go chrome powders. Go chrome yeah, they make chrome powder. I like. Oh, I just wanted to make that. And I remember when we seen the hobby store, I was like, well, if he's trying to do some kind of mirror, he needs an electro plate. <laughs> Until today, I still don't know how they make chrome powder. I just know there's good chrome and there's bad chrome. <laughs> at the bottom like this. Honey, I'm over here just making it so that you don't have options to. You are sacrificing yourself, I am so I don't ruin my diet. You don't ruin your diet. No, no, oh. yeah. All right, now uh, uh, next stop, I need to pop coat this very really quick. Um, the sky. Let's do matte, and then the water shiny. Optional, it's your choice. Mm. Pride now. I want some pride now. Pride now. I did one pride now. I would do it again. When is pride end? I wonder. Mm. 
What brand of monomer is the best for beginners? Uh, are you know that monomers? Know that studios. You're welcome. Alish, a a. Or oh, entity is very good too. I'm gonna you a um, Matt Top Co. Are you an entity? When I first um started, are you Tammy Taylor? Now Tammy Taylor is a fast acting monomers. My pigment doesn't stick after sixty second cure. 60 second cure on what background? Yeah, what kind of, what, mm -hmm. what are you applying the pigment on? Yes, if you apply matte, then you have to cure it for 10 seconds. Apply pigment and then you re cured it. If you have pigment base, 60 second will be perfect for you. And then make sure that you have my pigment because remember my pigment are different. Hello, pink lips. Okay. Now the mat. Just on the sky. When I get to the water, I'm gonna stop right here. Here. How can I apply chrome correctly? Uh, you need a chrome base or any of the product that cannot use chrome, like metal effect gel, texture effect gels. Uh, if you should apply apply plain chrome on the background then make sure you have chrome base right here let me show you what the bottle looks like oh honey 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 Bethany says i have been doing nails for four years so what age did you start uh no I, she's trying to figure out right how old you, you, are. you try to figure out my right, age right right oh, remember i'm always 21 right so always and forever we'll just say he didn't have a calendar back then he's not sure how old he was because asian his parents, anyway, don't celebrate birthdays, so who knows how old he is. And then after you rub on your chrome powder on an appropriate uh, foundation, like chrome base or texture effect or metal effect, 3D jelly, uh, clear texture gel, any of the product that cannot hear chrome, then you top coat it. And uh, if you want, you can top coat it twice. What you can do is make sure you tap the edge very well. So it don't chip up. Now, if you have clients that are rough on their chrome and you have chipping problems, then what you can do is apply one layer of sticky before you top coat. Let me show you what sticky is like. We are running low on sticky, or maybe we sold out sticky, I'm not sure. So but I'm sticky right here, apply on and over the chrome here for 60 seconds. And then you can apply top coat on because sticky is not a top, it's a base. So it's like a double side tape. It's adhered to your chrome and then it's adhered to your top coat. Still make sure that you wrap the edge and the side very well. I think you were 17 when you started doing those, right? I don't know. I don't know when I started. I just know that I've been doing that for 14 years and I'm still 21. <laughs> um, I'm about to turn 21 again this year. Mm -hmm. Good morning, Erica. Hi, Erica. How long until you were able to do your nails with your non dominant hand? Oh, no. That's never happened with me. I'm, I'm, I'm stuck with my dominant, my uh, non dominant hand. I'm a right-hand person. I my right hand do my left hand very well, but my left hand on my right hand I never attempted. Oh, I suck, you guys. So, would it be good advice to not do anything that you would not regularly do, and things that'll keep you from being? If you're right-handed and you try to take your left hand and do it, it's not gonna be as good as your right hand. And there's really no reason to do it unless you plan on losing your hand. No, you can do it if you want. If you want to do your nail that bad, then you can just try to practice. And over time, you get a little better and a little better. But I never attempted to uh, do my own nails, especially using my left hand to do my right hand. There's no way. That's talent. You're talented. Erica said, "I've been. I keep getting kicked out. I've been over here trying to block her. You think that's a problem?" <laughs> <laughs> just playing. <laughs> Okay, now I put on a layer of top coat on the water. Let's go all the way so it's nice and even. Turn it upside down to make sure that it gets rid of the left handle. 
the love handle. Yeah. This getting rid of the love handle thing, this isn't leading to you're no longer on a diet and you lost in this man up, but are you? I should have to turn myself upside down multiple times in a day. I need a yoga swing. <laughs> okay, apply top coat just on the waters and run all the way down. Right here, I'm adding a little more top coat so it's not bumpy. Mm. Oh my God. <laughs> How long until you, you were able to do nail art like this? Oh, when I first got in, I was standing out from the crowd immediately. Um, my nail art improved over time. Every single day is improving. Uh, so I, I improving it over time, but it, it doesn't. It's not like I spend a few years studying it and then, and then I succeed at studying it. No, I. It's, it's I, a never ending story. It's really. a never end with me. I, I start out, um, kind of like an inventor's. I invent my own technique and I look at uh, different special effects online and I study it, I analyze this and I create technique. So my story on uh, learning nail art is a little different than your stories on learning nail art. Well, you're giving shortcuts. Right, now I just show you and you practice and then after like, I don't know, a few months or a year or whatever, then you just get good at what you do. It's not happened like that with me. No one around to teach me at all. So all my technique is self-taught. I first started out my zebra design. That I do zebra design. That's why I first started out. And then move to butterfly and move to painting. And then I want to do portrait, of course. And when I first start, start out, it's not very good. And then over time, I practice and get better and better. So the best, best they be hating me. Oh, I thought her name was Bethany or something. <laughs> now that I'm reading it correctly. Jeez. Uh, so, maybe, okay. so it's not like it's not like I started out and then I count the dates. Oh, three years. I'm finally good at nail art. I'm gonna stop now. I'm not gonna learn anything else. It's not like that. I know. It's more like until this day, I'm still learning. I'm still developing, and it will never stop until the day I die. And then. Because I know that that's what's really good for growth. What I do is, is I whisper in his ear at night, and I say things like, "You're horrible. You need to get better." <laughs> you need to... <laughs> now it's a little bumpy right here. Uh, Jaslyn, have... yes, you can send the homework. So or... you have two choices. Um, you can either leave it bumpy if your client are okay with it, because it's a water surface, or you can take a um, a file and file up the bumps. Make sure you look on the side just for you to see everything easy. Don't worry if you accidentally file anything up, but remember it's texture. So it's okay. And you can even put some, some more stained glass gel on when you're done. So file away. Uh, I know I've asked this before, but I can't find where I put it. The file to buff on that to do art. Um, that is Tammy Taylor Clean Finish Buffing File. Go on Amazon and type in Tammy Taylor Clean Finish Buffing File. It will appear. You know, Abby? So, Danny, we said hi. Um... <clears throat> She was saying that the zebra is a lot harder than, than a lot of people realize. That's something that I have noticed is is the things that look like they would be simple are usually the hardest designs. So everybody was talking me into doing a zebra design, a gay zebra design, a rainbow zebra design. Is that, what the, <laughs> is that what's happening? I don't think anybody said anything about it. They insinuated like it. Somehow flying in your head. Um... <laughs> Uh, yes, we're a couple of, I'm not sure what we're a couple of, but we're a couple of them. Ooh, 
cool. Steps, we missed you too. When we I missed everybody. When right? I filed this, uh, some of the white texture is shown through. Would it even more pretty? Like the texture of the uh, actual ocean, you know, what this little white wave. That's pretty. Oh. Oh. The D. says, <clears throat> I started doing nails at 10 and I am now 14. I'm being promoted to high school and I started doing nails because of you and watching your videos. Oh. Well, that's why they're hating you. You're so damn smart. That is awesome. That is super awesome, young talent. Who are you? Oh, I don't know. Who are any of us? <laughs> Question is, is, who are you? And if you don't know, you probably shouldn't even be here. <laughs> Wasting the screen space with your frivolous questions. <laughs> Make sure it's not one of those scam or one of those bots. Before we had one of the bots that asked in the same question too, it turned out to be a bot. Cause it started to like uh, come in badly on everyone. So watch out for it. If it uh, have a sign that is a bot, let me know so I can boot it out. Oh, okay. Like, I don't like robot um, on on well, our page. It says now which country? So that's probably you know not a bot, but the deal is this. She doesn't even have a nail in her name, so I mean, how much attention? No, just be careful. Beep. Don't make conversation with it. The, the learning process. Just be careful. If it's a robot, let me know so I can boot it out. And for our next act, we're going to be juggling little kittens. <laughs> Thank you, Gigi, because you are so amazing. Thank you for inspiring me. Thank you. And he looks pretty good, too. <laughs> okay, buffer is a little bit. Watching your videos gives me such inspiration to play more with nail art. Thank you, thank you. Nail art is supposed to be fun. That's why I create product to make all kind of different special effects. You know, what, the way I look at it, from someone who does not uh, care about anything but Tina when it comes to the nail art world. I've seen what happiness all these beautiful ladies would get from him. And as an emp empathic person, I'm like, man, how, you know? So every time I see someone doing great with their nail stuff, it's like, I know that they're going to- It's going to make a lot of people happy. They're going to be a positive person in this world. Yeah. Like Lance, for instance, um, she is not. Uh, <laughs> she does beautiful artwork, but she's kind of like in the realm of you. She's not doing those for anybody. She's not going to be able to, you know. <laughs> the joy of art. The joy of art. The joy of art. Yeah. Yes, I'm making sure that it's not bumpy. It's optional. It should depend on your client, what they want. That's why I don't go too thick of a white texture effect or else it's going to be super bumpy. This one is not too bad. Okay, now the white, if you want to cover the white, you can cover it with some stained glass gel. I'm leaving the white because I'm liking it. I tried one of your designs, took me five hours to finish, but that's okay. Mm -hmm. Make sure you get it right. That's all. That's all it matters. Get it right first, and then the speed come later. Yes, yes. All right, now. I uh, let's see. Hmm. Or maybe I can just put a little stained glass gel on. Little light stained glass gel on, like number seven. Let's see what uh, it look like. Let's do this one first. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Such a cute lab, honey. <laughs> and a beautiful smile. Okay. Oh, okay. So I'm using number seven, a light blue, like an aqua blue. I should apply it just a little bit on the waters. The so nail buffer is 240. 240, yes. See, just a little light blue on here. We are from Springfield, 
Missouri. Yes. The light blue. Thank you, thank you. The ocean. Did you say ocean or ocean? Ocean. That's why my heart belong is in the ocean. Is that why every time you use the name plan you're like Kiss, kiss yes. Kiss the it's like kissing the ocean. <laughs> I thought you were kissing the I ocean. Just, probably I was not. messing with dust, and every time I eat an oyster, I know he hates oyster. Uh, Tino's done a bride of Chucky nails. Yes. Quite a while ago. Yeah. Last, up somewhere in November or uh, October. November. October's last year in October. Yeah. Um. So we would never do a one-on-one -on -one class. It would be unfair to everyone else. Yes. We are considering some new dynamics and having some classes, but they will not be cheap at all. I want a color missing uh, class, you guys. Um, so this week, there's this guy. I don't know. He's, he has been hounding me for like three years. Teach me some color mixing. Teach me some color mixing. I said, I'm busy. I don't have time to do color mixing. But... Uh, Finally, one day, I say, I'm, I'm, I'm busy. I have to go to Orlando. Maybe when I come back. Well, guess what? On the way back, he texts me and say, do you home in Orlando yet? Like you had the GPS on the car. So, so I like, fine. I will give you about uh, 15 minutes. I'll give you 15 minutes. So I go online. It's, gonna, it's more than 15 minutes. It's like 45 minutes. But I'm loving to teach how to mix color, how to learn, understand about color theory. So I'm thinking I want to class up that. It's very complex. Uh, I don't know if I would do live on that, but uh, after uh, showing him the color theory, I feel inspired now. So I don't know. Yeah. It's a little plan. Just a plan. Thank you, Tara. Okay, now um, let me see top coat and then probably do some art. But uh... let's uh Let's paint it some art on now because the sugar gel is embossed. Um, bubble effect is embossed too. So, um, Chas, we wouldn't want to make a video to purchase either. That's that's what other people do. That's too much time. We, we, we got to do us the way we do us because right now it's not a job and we're happy just doing it. Okay, so let's do like an umbrella. So, I'm going to take pigment base because it's a white gel polish. Good day, Swiss pot. So any white gel polish will do. Are you ever going to nail pro shows to present your product that would be uh, so good because many people can know about it? Uh -uh. Uh, we, we like the slow rate we're going. Okay, so um, probably an umbrella here. Uh, probably a beach ball right here. Yeah. We, uh, we sold out of a lot of things, but we did not get enough money for the island. <laughs> <laughs> okay, an umbrella first, and then we'll see about that. An umbrella right here. An umbrella? Yeah, an umbrella. And <clears throat> Tino chooses not to use uh, stamping techniques, but if it's something that you're good at mm -hmm. and, and it helps you get through clients quicker, then go for it. Yes. Yeah, you can definitely use stamp an umbrella. I don't know about the textures or the sky, but an umbrella, yes. Okay. Is that what an umbrella look like? I feel like I need to Google an umbrella. <laughs> Let me see. Well, we don't have any extra. You want me to get the umbrella and let you look at it? Okay, probably something like this. And probably something okay. I'm gonna get a brush. I'm just gonna use my memories. Of an umbrella? Of an umbrella. I can get an umbrella and let you look at one. Yeah, give me an umbrella. Okay. I'm a visual person. I need to see it.
Yeah, this looks like an umbrella. Ever since we started running in the rain, I don't know the umbrella's at. It's okay. I'm just guessing. Yeah. Just an umbrella. Yeah, easy to you say. You go ahead and draw an umbrella. <laughs> okay, probably like this. Look, there's an umbrella right there on the screen. Well. Right there. It's, oh, oh. Thank you. Oh, yes. Sweet. Red and yellow. Yes, yes. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Oh, it's flatters. Thank you. That's helped a lot. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, here's a bunch of umbrellas. Let me see. Okay, so it's, uh, it's flatters. Hold it. Let me see. I need a tuna brush to remove some of the details. Probably need some alcohol. Okay, flat in the base, round the end. Um, where'd she go? Uh, they be hating me, so we're not attached to our phones like most people believe. So after we get done, we're going to go get some soup so that Tino has a little nutrients in the system. And then <clears throat> uh, we're doing two more lives today. Thank you. So probably this evening is when we will check the emails. Yes. Just be patient, sweetie. Good morning, Lab Judy. Uh, if no pigment base, do you cure with cure white less time? Uh, no, any white gel polish will do. And uh, I would say 60 seconds is my preferred time. Make me safe, feel safe. Uh, less time will be okay too, but I mean, whatever, it, as long as it's dry for you. I always cure everything for 60 seconds. It makes me feel safer. Safer. We are having... So I don't wake up at the night and like, oh shit, I'm going to kill that for 40 <laughs> seconds. I oh, wonder if she, it's okay with her. <coughs> Text my client, is it chip yet? Is it chip yet? Is it chip yet? <laughs> Call at 3 a.m. So we were having bad dreams about your nails. <laughs> I just have a dream that the nail chipped. Is it true? <laughs> is it true? <laughs> okay, uh, I probably... Uh, Let's see. Let me erase the inhibition layer first, and then we'll see. This clouds look off for real. Thank you. I'm gonna paint it yellow first. <laughs> Graffiti pen. Taking it out. Graffiti. graffiti pen. Clean this first. I always clean when I take out a pen. Just clean up dry ink. Then now, color it in. Actually, I'm going to color it red and yellow too. Ooh. Yeah. No, I plan to color everything yellow, but let's do red <laughs> and yellow. <laughs> oh, I need to close my my uh, cap. I could just let it stay out the air too long. Okay. Good morning, nannies, babies. You've helped me so much in this short amount of time, and I have, haven't even made it to all the lives. Yeah. You know, I, I, I really do feel like his teaching ability is phenomenal. Well, hello, Clyde. Hi, Clyde. What are you doing, Daddy? Huh? Did you check on the babies? Man, that was amazing, wasn't it? It was. 
Some yellow, yeah. What are you going to do with the end of the nail? I don't know yet. I'm going to add some beach ball, some umbrella, some bird flying in the sky. Looks very stormy. Maybe some palm Beautiful. tree. I don't know yet. Red. Shake it. Open it. Cleanse it a little bit. Okay. So that's what we're thinking. Instead of having classes for students, we're thinking about having classes for teachers. Yes, for educators. That way more people are getting the talent out there. We had five beautiful I know. kittens. I'm it's really one of just tough one. I can't wait to do Bucks Live on uh, TikTok. Tomorrow I do some gay stuff. <laughs> but um, you some gay nails. Tomorrow some gay... we'll be doing gay stuff on our, our... Gay nails, not, not gay stuff like... Uh, just gay nails. So we're not doing I the... I forgot uh, about the gay... Only uh, fans page? About the pride. So um, tomorrow I do some gay stuff. Uh, but today I'm doing Bucks Live. <laughs> well, that yellow and red just made that pop. Yeah. Some yellow right there, too. I forgot. Tino, why do you like using the pins for this art instead of gel? It's thin. It's thin. Uh huh. Ah, uh, let me see. What else do I need to do? Maybe a palm tree coming out. Probably like right here coming out. Yeah. Yeah, I should do a palm tree. So do a palm tree. take this pen out. Brown. Uh, so probably a palm tree, just like an umbrella, it just doesn't have all the cool cloth. Is it possible to mix ordinary and gel lacquer, or will ordinary you, lacquer react in another way under LED? You mean mix it with a pen. You can use a matte top coat. You can mix it with matte top coat. That's the only thing that works. Oh, a shark fin pick. But gel, mixed with gel, other gel, that's fun too. Okay, some brown right here for some palm tree. Actually, make it higher. Probably past the sky right here. Oh, a table with pina coladas. Oh, maybe. Got some palm tree here. Maybe some palm tree down here. I don't know. Yeah. Manatee. Got the palm tree down here too. She means gel and regular polish mix. No. Oh no. No. You can't. So different base in it. It will mess you up big time. You can't. Uh I need some up the cream. You as well, be baby Hayden. Press it. Let's stay. So distribute our. If it doesn't come out, clean it a little bit. It will come out. See, so clean it. Just remove old ink, and then squeeze it, making like a deep shade of green first. Actually, I'm gonna paint on like a light green first. <clears throat> if it's too much ink, wipe it out. Abby said, "I have 
your graffiti pens already, but I have yet to use them. I am completely at all of their pigmentations. Being able to Isn't paint it? over blue is impressive. Oh, yeah. I just got the graffiti pens, and holy crap, yours is the best. Mm -hmm. I bought others from other people, and those don't compare. Isn't it? That we're going to teach you how to use them. Right. I miss what you said was the kids I think I heard my name. So some green, some green here, and then I go in with like a deeper green. So the markers do not crack with top coat? Mm -mm. It crack under a very cold room or very, yeah, very cold room. It can crack, but that is just what acrylic pen do. If it too cold in your room and if it crack, don't panic. Just top coat it on, it will seal it. Yes, yes. Make sure it dry before the top coat though. Capsule 2 for one says, can I find those on AliExpress? Not the ones that he purchases. Mm -hmm. You can and find all you kind of things. Gamble with your money, go for it. Yes. Cheap is not cheap. I have a lot of people trying to, uh, especially there are a couple of company already trying to uh, go before me on the pen. They send spy to watch my live, and then they decide to come out it before me. But they did not do a proper job of educating. So now it's crashing down. Me, I just take, good my, because just take my time. There's so much that people can do with it. We hate it when other companies I know, right? have a product. And just ruin it for people. Fail, and then they get discouraged and give up. Right. So okay, I'm mixing up. it with some blue. Don't give up. Just a little blue right here. Uh, I feel like I need some yellow too. Mixing it with this blue to make it warmer. Ain't that true shanna fixer she says haters will never prosper mm -mm. Mm. i don't panic i like whatever i took my sweet time <laughs> uh i need some brown actually oh, I Ooh, can I fly? Mm -hmm. no uh it's make make a screen deeper i hope you hope yeah it's more blue Okay. Doesn't seem like it's turned out the way I like it. Let's say some blue and some yellow to see what happens. Just a little blue, a little yellow. A bit hard to come out, clean this first. There. Oh, yes! <gasps> Blues and yellow is beautiful. Yes, it's the color that I want. Yes, yes, yes. Mm, beautiful deep green. Okay, I'm ready. All right, we're going to give them a, a quick little shot of one of the key little titans. Look at the little titan. So the face, show your face. Oh, you yeah. Oh, he's so cute. <laughs> Okay, so I mix yellow with blue, and I'm very happy with the colors, so let's do it. Just paint it out like this. Okay. What else I need? Now, before I put the yellow in, I'm gonna roll it so it's get rid of the green color that I just make. Ah, <laughs> what else? What else? Okay, right now I'm gonna maybe uh, outline this a little bit, maybe shade it a little bit and outline this a little bit. So the umbrella, let's take some white art gels, paint it a little white outline for it so it can stand out in the waters. Mm. 
Mm. Yeah. Just a little trick to uh, make make the object stand out more. And sharpen the edge. Since the pen is only uh, fill in color, it couldn't make it as sharp as I wanted. So I want it to be really sharp. It's precise. Here. Yeah. Maybe on the palm tree too. And a little detail on the trunk. Uh, ocean nails, you do not cure the pen. Mm -mm. It's air dry. Air dry. Mm -hmm. Um, will this video go on YouTube? No, it's uh, go on Instagram right here. It'll right after I'm done, I'll save it on Instagram. We'll put it on his tinovo.shop page. Yeah, the only thing I on YouTube is my TikTok live. Instagram, when I save it, it's a little blurry. So I'd rather for it to be on here. Um, let's see, maybe a little white. Mm -hmm. mm. I want to start doing your YouTube's tutorials from YouTube. I feel I'll grow so much doing that. Yeah, you yeah, will. yeah. Which glue do you use for? The nail stands. So those are glue dots. Yes. <clears throat> Boy, how far the beauty of palm trees has come. The beauty of palm tree. Well. This just be a little, a little silhouette. A little silhouette. And now it's like after after Florida, after you get to touch one. <laughs> can you use a liner brush with the graffiti pens to you can. detail work? Yes. yes. It dry look quick. Ooh. Do you have stones as the coconuts for the pina colada? <gasps> Oh, that's a good idea. I don't think I will put on here, but you can. Uh, the color is smoke topaz. That's what you, you want to use if you want to use stone. Use smoke topaz. Um, maybe a little sand glass gel for the shape. I'm getting fancy with the palm trees. Oh. Maybe a stained glass gel. <laughs> Did you have the palm tree in there? Yeah, we had to because there was a hurricane coming through. Oh my God. I was like, quick, grab a tree. They're still here <laughs> from the last hurricane. Hmm. Slow. You don't have to make it this fancy. Really? I just want to show you more um, technique. That's all. Get it. Because <laughs> after the show, we, um, I have realized I need to show more technique just to uh, open people up a little bit, you know, making them understand what to use, what, why, when, stuff like that. So, you don't have to make it fancy, but I just use technique just because to show people. Cause some people are like, oh, what is that glass gel? What does it do? You know what I mean? So, I just want to show. Um, sun glass gel, I love the color, I love the fade, because it's very forgiving, it's light, it's not opaque. It's okay, I think I'm done. I think I'm done. So now, I'm just going to do matte again, because this was unplanned. Uh, I already put a layer of matte on the sky, but I'm going to do it again, because uh, it wasn't planned to do matte. Uh, to, to put the uh, umbrella and the palm tree on, so now. Good morning, Aunt Deb. Hi, Aunt Deb. I have to debate with myself, should I do, put a bird on? No, I, I put a bird on after with black art gel so I don't have to put top coat on. Okay, Matt, everything. Lemon grass soup. Mm-hmm. Sound good. 
But we have two more lives today. We can be logging. We have to. Can't we just call? To... Boom, pick it up. Boom, come back. All boom, right. eat boom. It, boom. <laughs> no, when we come back, I do be doing live, and then you'll be eating it. Okay, you're right. You're right. <laughs> I know your evil plans. My own, okay. I know your evil plans. <laughs> like I'm day, I have like a TikTok live, which I'm gonna be painting bugs, so it's gonna take forever. <laughs> and then I'm gonna do a crystal live tonight. Uh, yeah, you better order extra. <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to see by the end of the night. <laughs> oh, <my goodness. laughs> that is a lot of uh, it is a lot of booms. I put a mat on everything just because I want to make everything even. Well, I almost got sleepy for a minute. Yeah. Keep the air out and cool it down. I'm going to better keep this away. Beach lounger, yeah. That would also be a good idea, too. Okay, now I'm going to take Shandit out. And actually put it on a palette this time and you like a pointy brush or like a line of brush to uh, add in for just water. Very realistic. Hey, Good morning, Sassafras. I'm thinking a, uh, a pointy brush will be fine. Pointy and round brush. Actually, you know what? Uh, let's do a seven millimeter brush smaller so it's better to uh, get in between all these layers details yeah and then the rest i'm just going to use the uh, top coat bottle and some shine it right here not too thick well it's very realistic Now I can use a top coat bottle to paint the rest of it. So I just realized something you said. What's that? You were talking about were you on a diet down in Florida? Me? Yeah. Um. I mean, because that night when we had to go up and pick up the Uber Eats or in the front lobby three, oh, three different times, yeah, three I different places, I didn't feel like we was on a diet. No, I, I, I except I, for the walk up. I wasn't on a diet too far. By the time when we get to the show, I like it's too late. It's too late. Might as well give up on it. <laughs> but now when we come back, this is our chance to be on a diet again. Well, thank you, Larry, Stephanie. This is an honor to watch you. Yes. Uh, G-Nails could be going on TikTok right after, well, not right after like, this. Not right after this, like uh, in the afternoon. In about I, I still have to do uh, a video of this first. That's why I want now is to do a video immediately. So I don't get overload with video by the end of the week. So how much would you charge for a design like this? Probably three hundred. You can charge more if you want. They could also charge less. Yeah, you can charge less if you want. Depend on how many layers, how detailed it is. Cut. All that I show you, I just showing you, just so you, you know uh, what you can add, what you can add. But uh, you can always just do a simple beach scene, throw in some waves, stuff like that. So it's up to you. And all my design can be adjusted by uh, adjusted by you. <clears throat> we we are considering moving down there with you. Down to Florida? Marie, yeah, Marie Ann wants I to go. Love but, 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 Nail Dad also wants us to move down there with him. I know, right? So, um, we're going to need you two to compete for our love. Ooh! I mean, you can cook, so you're already. But then John's got his mom who cooks. Oh, yes. Right, right. So who I couldn't gonna... understand. I know, right? There is no telling what she had. She had this thick accent. I couldn't understand. She gave me uh, a bunch of ham. Kia pork, actually, Kia pork. And she said either. And she said either uh, you can eat it within a day or you wait till a day to eat it. And we weren't sure. So we either way, it's 50 50. And, Yeah. <laughs> we 
We just got done with Florida, which was a lot of fun. We have fun everywhere we go, though, don't we? Yeah. I just finished taking some pictures yesterday, so I have 10 more content. Whoa. New content this week to post. Check this out. She said it's great here, but watch out for the Florida man. What's that? I don't know. Uh, sugar gel, please. So let's clean this up and we move on to another technique. Sounds like a swamp monster or something. A Florida man. Is that like a boogie man? That's kind of what kind of what it, my assumptions would be. Oh, tonight we're gonna watch from I'm so excited. Every Sunday I'm like a little kid. I'm so excited to watch these horror movies. It doesn't make any sense. Um but, <laughs> but yeah, every time it comes to Sunday, it got like the scariest movie ever. Uh, uh scariest T V show ever. Uh so, so I'm like a little kid every Sunday, like, yay, I get to watch. Um, <laughs> Scary <yay."> shit. <laughs> Thank you, Billy. <sighs> yes, because they boy, isn't that an awesome show? They, they, they keep you guessing. I love from. I'm looking forward to it every uh, week. Okay, now, uh, Sugar Chow. Ooh. White sugar gels and pigment. I'm using the tan pigment, super pigment, tan super pigment, and white sugar gel. I'm mixing it in. Ooh, we have not seen Evil Dead. Evil Dead? It look a little scary in a bad way. Is it good? No. I don't like like. Exorcist movie because it's depressing. We're doing great, Gloria. Well, we like. Oh, anxious Tara said, said, Florida man is an internet joke. If you Google Florida man, it will come up with the most wild news article. Oh, okay. Pro coming from the girl in Scotland who sent us this Lucknet monster. Oh, I, I Photoshop would have been better somehow. You know? <laughs> I, mean, I was like, oh my goodness. I think I add a little too much tan pigments. So I need, I need a little oh more white. God, it looks like cinnamon. cinnamon it's, it's a little oh. too much tan pigment. It looks edible. I need more white sugar gel. Just a little this time. Yeah, just a little. Just a tiny bit. Yeah, this more like it. <laughs> I had too much. I would distract and listen to the Florida men. I know, right? Okay, mm -hmm. this is the sand I want. That's the sand you want? Yes. So you have dark sand and sand sand. So now, closing my tan pigments. Are you pigmenting because sugar gel, you don't need top coat. So are you pigmenting instead of gel? Because I don't want to add top coat into it. My Lockie was a work of art. And yes, yes, very abstract. Very. <laughs> I'm using flat brush, by the way. Flat brush. Okay, using a flat brush, I'm going to add in my sugar gels. Mm, I need a little alcohol. Make it softer. Yes, she did. She had Loch Ness had a little cute little had her nails done and everything. You know, I was believing that was a for real picture until I seen the nails. And I'm like, who does Lockie's nails? How's that even work? Oh, oh, <laughs> you know, <clears throat> Shanna, that's that's awesome. Says, sorry, I'm not in the nail business. I'm blocking her right now. <laughs> <laughs> but your art totally distracted me, so I get it. Yes, Thank that you. that actually is cooler to know that his talent, for me anyway, to know that his talent is entertaining and makes people happy that aren't even involved in nails. 
I love it. So the evil dead is like dark evil. Mm -hmm. Shows a lot of blood and very, very stressed movie. Mm -hmm. It's a good one. We like creepy, scary. I like mind bending, mystery, scary, but new age scary. Yeah. Like, um, I don't like it to be depressing, even. We don't like I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. Chainsaw Master stuff is kind of like blah. Uh, right now, our life is very good, so we don't want to watch like exorcists. Is that amazing? Like, things that are like. Spirit True free, evil, like a creepy like, ass, like exorcist or like a sinful, or like I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> uh, unholy, I don't want to watch unholy movie. I don't know how to explain it. I'm I'm so confusing right now. Sharda, Sh rarely would we ever block anyone. When I see Evil Dead, it gives me a bad vibe. It's like that girl is freaky. I don't know. I might give it a Have chance. You... I give it a chance. We can always give it seven minutes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, will you need to top coat over sugar? No, nope, no, nope, no. Nope. You don't have to. <laughs> Isra, I was being sarcastic. She she says she wasn't in the nail business. So I immediately said, well, we're going to block it. <laughs> He's just kidding. <laughs> Aw, that was sweet. Miss Blue Ball said, loves watching you because you're such an artist. Oh, thank you, Miss Blue Ball. Is it scary one is not exorcist? Like, uh, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. Good morning, Paris Summers. Hi, Paris Summers. You remember who Paris Summers was? Yes. The oh, the name? Yeah. The Dangerous Nail Tech. Oh. And remember, she almost broke some shit. And I was like, oh, yeah, I get it now. I get oh, okay. It. She okay, was okay. almost dangerous. Almost put her on. <laughs> okay. So after this, I am going to clean up from two sides a little bit. Rid of those little love handles. Love handle. I'll get rid of it. Oh, it looks like the beach from Portugal. Oh. I'll tell you what, I forgot how to say your name, Vienna, but truly, we will make it down to Portugal at some point. I can mm. see that in the future. It's, it's absolutely just Travel, definitely so, beautiful. Like so beautiful. And then, you know, everyone wants us to go places and, and teach. Yeah, we're, we're giving everything we can on this platform for free. And if we go to these beautiful places, we just want to enjoy it. Feel up fresh. But also the learning process is understandable. So <clears throat> I've come up with this idea. You just have to whisper to Tino and ask him <laughs> questions while he's sleeping. And then, well, that's what I do. Unfortunately, I always speak in Vietnamese, and then I got to record that, and then I got to go to Google Translate. I'm going to use a feel of breath to carve out like a feet. Okay, let me see where feet. my feet. Yeah, like a, like a feet. Like footprints in the sand? Footprint in the sand. You know what? Let's do a feet here. Let's do some duck feet. So I'm just removing it. So that... Hey, we have beautiful kittens. Have you picked out a kitten yet? You want to keep? Mm, not yet. I mean, we're I gotta wait until all. they are like a week old to see which one is cute and which one is not cute. They're all cute. We don't know right now. They they so small. What are you gonna do with an ugly kitten? We, I mean, how are you gonna explain to the kitten? It's, it's not ugly? gonna be my kitten. You can. We oh, just, I get the ugly one. We just one? sit it down and we say, "Listen, <laughs> we love all our children the same, but there's always a but. But you have to earn it." Oh, okay. So that's that's, that's and that your brother and sister I mean, who don't have to earn it, you have to. Mm. Well, how, how do you think Lucy feels right now? I don't know. Lucy's a little disgruntled. Did you see him come running out of there like 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 they were gonna slap him with some kind of child support or something? You see the kitten? He's like, oh shit! The rejection kitten. <laughs> the rejection kitten. Yes. 
No, we love all animals. The same. If you have sibling, you know, you know that that <laughs> always a uh, uh, favorite. Hopefully, it's you, but you know, it's, it's always be the other so one. So the rule of thumb is, if 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 you've not been told you're the favorite, you have to earn it. You're probably not. Yeah. You're the shitty kid. Right. Four toes. Yeah, I'm decided I just four toe. Instead of five, just four. It's awful. Cute. I mean, like a four toe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hold on, I think we got a serious question. Where to go? Sorry for all the questions. Maybe asked before. If you do not have a lamp to cure, possible to go out in the sun to cure? For example, if on a holiday. And forgot the lamp. Oh, 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 oh. Um, no, <laughs> not in the sun. The sun will kill it, but you need like you need timing. You need timing. You need timing. That's a very interesting question. It really is. I, actually. I kind of like. I it. don't recommend you in the sun. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, right when the nails cure, birth, so funny. skin cancer, and ah, uh, no wonder you're the sun. <laughs> It's inconsistent. It's like this. It's like, oh it's not like your body where it's cured evenly. No. Your body doesn't even cure evenly. Right? Um, now we got let me try cure. to find an example. Cause yes, it's neat it's an example. example. Okay. It's like, it's like, it's like, okay, if you want to smoke some salmon, but you don't have to smoke, uh, can you blow cigarette on it? And smoke it and yeah if you blow cigarette on the salmon if some part of the salmon probably be smoked but not all of it no it's not a good I example, don't, I don't that's a good example it's not a good example i'm, I'm oh, trying okay. to find an example because it needs an example uh let me see i'm gonna put clear acrylic on it just to make it mad, I feel like mad just don't leave your light behind Try to find an example. Okay. Mm. Okay. Oh boy, here we go. Like, uh, like hairspray. If you forget your hairspray at home, <laughs> um, you can use a uh, chism. You can use crystal magic clue oh. for hair for your no. hair. But <laughs> I'm trying to think. Let me think about it. We'll get back to you on this one. It's very interesting. Can you use the sun to cure the nails? Let me see. Good morning. I'm just just. I'm trying to find some good, really good examples. It's gotta be something that's really good. Honey, what did you use for the sand? The sand. I use sugar gel. Tara's already got it. Thank you, Tara. Yeah, uh, I'm still back to the sun part. Okay, let me see. Uh, what should I do as an example? There gotta be a Come on, guy. Think for me. There gotta be some example on it. Like, um, some things. <laughs> you the sun to keep now. <laughs> I hope you don't do no, chrome. Yeah. You know, I think it'd be quicker to use polish at this point. I hope you don't do chrome. Oh, so like cooking an egg in the hood of a car. Well, we, yeah, we did. Car, we did it before. Cheap. We can. Yeah, um, <laughs> need something better. If you don't have sugar gel, what could you use? If you don't have sugar gel, what can you use? Now, that is a question that I can make an example out of. <laughs> um. You can get some sand on the outside. So outside, hopefully you live in Florida. If there's some grainy sand and you mix it in with gel and hopefully that that sand that you find is compatible to nail products. <laughs> um Honey, you can be hurting her feelings right now. You can use you, you gel. Know what, you can know that we're laughing with you, not at you. You can use gel if you don't have sugar gel. You can uh, settle. You can do a compromise. You can use a tan gel and you can mix clear acrylic on it. It will not give you that sandy textures. It's just gonna be matte, and with uh, like a flat matte 
gel, which is fine. But the reason I use sugar gel because it's sand, it's like actually looking sandy. But without sugar gel, it feels like it too. Gel is built for it to be smooth. So if you mix acrylic powder on it, it's still gonna be smooth. It's it's gonna be matte, but it's still gonna be smooth. So sugar gel so far is the only thing that I have that it look give it like a little bumpy sandy texture. But without sugar gel, the only thing that you can get is something sandy that not belong to the nail product community, like something that with texture on it that the gel refuse to uh, smooth out. But gel usually do to smooth it out. So sugar gel is kind of like a hybrid between a um, between uh, texture effect gel and some foreign material. What about gypsum gel? Gypsum gel, yeah, gypsum gel will do that too. Just as long as it have texture. I mean, this is a product where you don't need education. It's can you do it like it's the, my eye. the Christmas sugar cookie set? Yes, you can. Ooh, good job. I can't wait to Christmas. Oh, I'm gonna do sugar cookie in Christmas. Last year is hideous. I have to make my own sugar cookie and it's flat. It's so flat, but this year, oh yeah. I can use it and then I can add some icing on it. Um, Let's do some bubble effect. Now this, I'm gonna have my bubble tech model out. So that is techniques number four. I don't know how many techniques I taught already, but this is number four, bubble effect. And I would need to make a milky consistency that uh, have been top coat and white polish. You want top coat to be more, so more top coat. Uh, Taking out some top coat and then white polish, I will add in like a um like a tiny bit, like thirty percent or so. Thirty percent. That's more. Than, that's yeah. That's, a third, that's it. Honey. That's it. Just like that. Now mix it all together. You don't want too much. You just want a tiny bit of white and a lot of top coat. Oh. Oh, Mary, Mary, I feel like I just got a gold star from the teacher. <laughs> I'm still trying to think of an example to yeah, not kill your nail in the just sun. Just let it go. Just let it go. Okay, okay. Just find the amusement in the burnt hand with, with the no cured okay. Joe Polish. <laughs> it's very inconsistent mm, when it comes to nail, uh, nail step the reason why you need a lamb with proper timing because certain uh, gel is require proper timing for its effect like chrome if you don't care for 60 seconds if you care for like 30 or 20 seconds the chrome not gonna look pretty so same thing i mean if you if you don't have the lamb um you might be able to cure the nails but you're not gonna be able to do special effect with it you need a lamb to do special effect splitting this together make sure you don't move too much just a little bit like here maybe I need to add some more top coat just in case I don't want too much white so I'm adding some more top coat I mix it all up. Now I will use a oval brush. Now don't dip in it. You have to scoop it. Do not just dip in it and stroke it. You have to scoop the whole thing. And then 
smudge it over the surface like this. And it's more bubble effect. Mm -hmm. I wonder where it doesn't go. Hey, What's that? What happened? This is off subject, but I've come to notice that we have a lot of black furniture. Uh -huh. And now we have a lot of black cats. Maybe we consider getting some white furniture. Maybe. So that we don't keep sitting and stepping on them. Can you do the bubble effects like, like with soap? That would be backpedaling a little bit. Yeah, because then it's, you cannot seal it. It's, it's not going to be smooth. Yeah, to fill in your holes and. It cannot be even. I want it to be inconsistent like this. Hear this? I want it to be in the gel, not just on top of the surface. Oh, somebody's being rude. Somebody's being rude. Right? Mm -hmm. It's a perception. It's just a perception. Oh, the man is old. Oh, the man is oh. old? Yeah, hey, don't don't worry about how she thinks I feel. <laughs> you know, how about her? Is she old? Right, you know. Papa. Those who come with judgment. <laughs> the man yeah, is let, old. Let her be her miserable self. No, don't call her her. It's, an, it's a robot. It's an it. Oh, it. <laughs> yes, yes. How a car troll and it. It don't deserve to call, be, call, be looked at as human. And remember it. It's your choice not to it's watch. A, it's a creature. It's a creature. <laughs> so back to the uh, white furniture. Uh -huh. As long as they don't shed, it should be okay. Right? I guess. <laughs> <laughs> uh, smudge it down. Smudge it down. Just like that. Smudge it down. How are we going to come up with this many names for the cats? Uh, we're just going to number them. One, two, three. How many colors are in the rainbow? Seven? Yeah. Let's just get them different color colors. And then we'll get whichever one you decide is the precious one. A nice, shiny rhinestone. I shouldn't put more top coat in. I want it to be a little brighter. Brighter? Yeah. But it's okay. I'm just gonna get some art gel. I'm gonna add in some brightness at the end. That is my solution. The art gel, you don't need to um, top coat it. Ooh! Just a I little would bit. like to see a Resident Evil set. Ooh! Not until Halloween. Not the way into Halloween. That's just right around the corner, right? Now. Yeah. Can you use cuticle oil if you don't have. No! Oh. No! No. You can't. Because when you top coat it, it fills it in, right? It's dangerous. It's dangerous. It's dangerous. It's dangerous. Don't do it. Don't, do don't it. you do it. <laughs> you know, it's tempting, but don't you do it. <laughs> I mean, yeah, try it. On, on a client, yeah, uh, but to... make sure she's not your favorite client, and then try it on her. Try it on your non-favorite client. Yeah, on your, on your yeah, 
just really find a client cool. that you don't really care for and then just try it. Because <laughs> if it works for you, you're like, yay, hallelujah. If it doesn't work, oh well. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait, what? Yeah, try it your unfavorite client. So now I want to try it. I know. Yeah, I, yeah, do it, do it, do it. <laughs> Just make sure she's not your favorite. <laughs> but wouldn't your favorite understand? No, no, the favorite is they probably get, get good tip. You cannot risk it. <laughs> but the the one that doesn't tip you, yeah, try on her. <laughs> And then if you are a client watching right now, you know how we feel. How <laughs> so next so time before, next time before you stand you on the tips, remember uh, we try on you. We we book you on your nails. Remember that. Remember that. We wouldn't even hesitate. <laughs> <laughs> we will book that you on your nails. <laughs> Oh, great. We're last indeed. I think she's taking care of kids again. Oh. Lastly, have kids? She, yeah, she had to feed them and everything. And everything. I don't want to try to avoid the bubble. I don't want to cope with the beautiful bubble that I just made. Oh, I guess you could try it on a practice tip it's not as fun as no because then you won't, wouldn't know if you know if it chip or not chip the only way you can test its functionality is on a living client who uses now every single day who scratches and picking up stuff and open soda can you need to try Shampoo with them you need to they need to be alive they need to be alive right but you, you don't want to waste a, a good client so you, you have a feel you know you have a feel that you wanna you wouldn't care for if it go away. Uh art child for uh, painted little bird on it. <laughs> the moment I say try something dangerous on your client, I'm sure in your head a feel will pop up. You know, there will be a couple of names. That will pop up. When do we get to see the kittens? Uh, not for a week. I don't know. I'm gonna go grab one. I'm, I'm gung ho on on getting them because yeah. of our last experience with them. Okay. Remember? Oh, here. Yeah. So cute. I can hear it mailing. Remember, Archie doesn't need top coat to so feel twice on it. Near the cloud, I painted tiny. Actually, these. Uh, the one on top make it make it bigger so it create dimension you know the one smaller from the distance and the bigger one are uh, far away uh, i mean smaller one are far away and the bigger one are closer that Yeah, this. I know, right? Oh, gracias, Elise. Gracias. Just love to touch these pictures. Okay, so what can I do? I think I'm done. What else can I do? Uh, order soup and then... No, I mean na nails wise. Oh. Yeah, I'm done. I'm done. It's the soup I had to do that. Oh, no. Just 
share this. <laughs> Now what happens if the mom abandons that cat? I don't know. We're gonna have to. We're gonna have our favorite that. first. We're gonna send it to Ashley. <laughs> she can do what? Oh no, she's right. kids, right? We gotta get her feet <sighs> All right, everyone, I am done. Yes, we. Uh, I need to make. I need to call and order some some soup, and then I need to make a. I need like thirty minutes to make a uh, video of this set. Yes, and then we had kitchen. I like it. Did you like it, Dustin? I love it. It's absolutely it's so beautiful. It's so beachy. Um, my favorite part is this one. I mean, the sky is totally heaven. I mean, look at the sky. The sky, the, the, the depth in it is, I love it. I love the depth. I'm glad that I use a lighter colors. Here, I just painted Austral straight on, which is fine. But this one, I add a little green on it to, because when the sun starts to pop out, it gives it a little like yellow mixed with blue. It's leave a little greenness. So I add a little green, just a tiny bit of green on my blue. So it's make it kind of like an aqua color. And then I store. fade in with blue. So it's the sky, definitely my favorite. But this whole water scene right here is definitely heaven. You see the ombre and the texture on it. Sugar gel is good too. Give it a little dimension. Ooh, yeah, starfish would have been good. Yeah, yeah but yeah, whatever. That would be a whole different beach scene. Yeah, not to, not today. <laughs> All right, everyone, we're going to go All get right. soup. Then... Right, have fun today. Uh, I come back later on TikTok. Uh, we're going to do a um, art gel. is different from regular gel polish, right? So art gel is just a gel paint that I make. Um, it's uh, good for line work. Um, art gel can also good for like uh, if you stroke full cover on a nail. It's good for that too. It can adhere chrome. It can adhere uh, pigment also. So it can adhere two things. Um, however, it's a jack of art trade. Like my metal effect gel is at here chrome way better than my art gel. Metal effect gel, when you put chrome on it, it's super shiny. Um, art gel is okay, but it can still adhere chrome. And it adhere pigment just as good at the, uh, almost as good at the pigment bay. However, pigment bay is my all time favorite to adhere pigment. But art gel can adhere pigment too, so it's like a jack of all trade. But I use art gel mostly for um, painting details or stroking background, stuff like that. Or one stroke, stuff like that. Okay, you guys. So, uh, what I also like is how you make this umbrella matte. So I matte everything and I just would shine on the water only. I like it. I'm very happy with this. Yay! All right. And I don't know if I can put crystal under it. I don't think I can. Uh, yeah, I don't think I can put crystal under it. It's just have to be a set without crystal, which is unlike me. I, I would like to put low crystal on the coconut, but I don't think so. Yeah, just no crystal. All right, everyone, I will see you later. Have a good day. Uh, in this afternoon, right now is one, uh, two, three. I'd probably be on at like three or three thirty central time. Yeah. We don't want to rush the suit. Yeah. Um, from the umbrella to the beach. Look, tiny one on the sand. Mm, I don't know what colors. What color can I use? Maybe like little coconut dropping? I don't know. Bye bye, Rose Now Artist. Bye bye, Girl 14. Uh, Tia, uh, uh, Tia Depp, um, I will be on TikTok next in the afternoon. Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to have two more. Um, TikTok gonna be like I wanna paint it like some cartoon, some bugs live. Cause okay, I just have the graffiti pen, so I really are uh, eager to use it. So I'm gonna use my graffiti pen. Um, but uh, tonight I have another life of crystal because I love to do crystal set now. So it's gonna be like a 
um, like a like a red crystal set using lights. I am. Uh, I'm gonna add some gold stud in there. I I just have this, which I'm so excited about. You remember the uh, the caviar beads that are in that are in like package like this. You remember this? Well, I finally have this. It's on its way to the website right now. But this is a uh, 0 0.8 millimeter tiny. And this 0 0.6 millimeter even tinier. And I'm going to make crystal art with that. So I'm excited. I'm excited for that. Uh, if you don't have TikTok, you can either download and make an account really quick. Or you just wait for it and I eventually will... Uh, Good on YouTube, uh, or and I also take things up live and make like short little video, little funny video. So okay, I'm gonna get up now. I see you later.